Today I am going to teach you the famous hook step of Ek Pal Ka Jeena. In this step, you are facing towards your left. So this is my left guys. So I am facing towards left, the side view. Okay. So when it's side view, your left leg is covered by your right leg, right? So your left leg is what is helping you to keep your body balanced. So your left leg is doing nothing other than helping you to keep your body balanced, right? So I will teach you first the leg step, okay? So now let's understand the music beat by beat, okay? So the beat is ti-ding, ti-ding, ding, ti-ding, ti-ding, ding. Now this ti-ding, ti-ding, ding. It's a four beats, but the second part of beat is little bit fast, okay? So in that four beat, what you are going to do, this is your left leg, which is straight. Don't keep your knees locked. Your knees should be loose, right? Unlocked. So now with this, 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 this should be your body so that you can do any movement. Don't keep your legs like this or this or this. Make a straight line of your body. Keep your knees loose, right? Then you can do a so much body movement, see? Now, try to have a balance on your left leg first, right? Then, now let's start. So what is the, with the music, what is the food for? It's ting, 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 ting. So now guys, if you have watched the video while Hrithik Roshan is dancing, you can see that he is moving towards the camera, towards the front. So in this step, you will do ting, 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 ting. So it's nothing but with your left leg, you are doing one, two, three and four. You are doing two beat and then you are shifting towards the camera, right? The right hand movement, okay? Because this is, this is the most challenging part. Now, if you have seen this step, he's doing one, two. I have already counted the beats, which is ting, 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 ting. Ting, 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 ting. So this ting, so this ting, in this ting, you will do two steps, one and two. So now you imagine before starting with this step with your right hand. Now imagine there is a drawer and that you have to push, push it twice to close it. Okay. So now suppose there is a drawer. You are pushing it twice. Push, push, push and push. So it's push, push. Okay, why I am telling you this? Because a lot of people do the mistake. They do it. Ting, ting, ding, ting, ting, ding, ding. No, your elbow will not cross your body line backwards. Okay, so if you see the step, it's ting. It's it's slightly you are going, but you are going more in front, front, front. It's not this, this. It's not this, this. It's this and this. One and two. So keep on practicing. Just imagine there is a drawer in front and you are closing it by pushing it twice. One and two. One and two. Alright. So now imagine, now you remember the footwork where you are doing one, two. So this is the step you will go one, two. One, two. One, two. Okay. Now what are we going to do with the left hand here? So, the left hand, you will keep it straight, okay? Have some strength. It shouldn't be like this, here, or this, open. It should be with your shoulder line. Make a straight line with your shoulder. It should be straight. No up, no down, no bending, no loose. Have some strength here, see? This is the strength I'm having with on my left hand. And I'm keeping it like this, straight your hand here or here okay it would be here loose okay so the step is one two one two one two all right now this is the two beat what about the other two beats right don't worry i'm gonna teach you that also so it's one two then on the third beat which is teeting Ding, ding ding okay ding ding you will do so one and two so you will shift the hands like this 
okay i'll i'll teach you in detail so that you don't get confused don't worry about it so it's 1 2 now you have already like your your right hand it's already up there so now this looks very stupid right so we are going to exchange the hands very fast okay so it would be 1 2 and then you will with this hand you will keep it close here so now your this hand which was there your left hand okay let me let me make it very clear this is your left hand so now le your left hand was there so your right hand was here now your right hand is going 1 2 so your left hand is coming here and replacing your right hand so it's 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 One, two, three, four. So and so now we'll do it together. The first part and the second part. And remember, the third part is left. But I'll teach you at the last because that's just a small touch you will give to the step. But you will only practice the third part once you are very used to with the first part and the second part. Okay. First the footwork, then the handwork, and then we'll go to the third part. Okay. Ting 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 ting. Right? Okay. So shall we do it with the music once? Okay. So what is the step? So you are doing ting ting, right? So when you are transitioning, ठीक है? When you are transitioning, you are looking here. like you are your body is already facing side but you are facing the audience the camera is here in front so this teeting and then when you are transitioning you are looking here teeting ting so this head step at the third count is the third part teeting teeting ting teeting teeting ting i hope you have understood the step i know this is a very complicated step it requires a lot of practice and along with the practice i would say it requires observation understanding of your body parts how you can move and how many body parts you can move in a beat obviously nobody can match the level of energy and the skills of rithik roshan i can understand but there is always a way to learn so try your best keep practicing and dm me if you find it still difficult to learn this step and please make a reel on it especially the hook step and let me know if this video has helped you thank you bye